Quick Permanent Remedy by Anna Von writes. I think all we really need to do is en masse declare our birthright political status as Americans and take over. I know it's a mind bender, but it is there the Federalist that is job to protect us, so long as we are Americans. They have created a false legal presumption that we are not Americans, and created falsified records in order to claim that we are U.S. citizens, as if we were born in Puerto Rico or working as federal employees. They can abuse U.S. citizens. U.S. citizens have no constitutional guarantees. U.S. citizens have no recognizable natural and unalienable rights. Some people think they are denying us access to the public law and our constitutional guarantees, but that isn't what is going on. They haven't touched that cheese. What they have done is to redefine us as being United States citizens or citizens of the United States or U.S. citizens and we are provably none of the above. We have been presumed to be in the same political status as Puerto Ricans, and until we rebut that and provide superior evidence, we've got no constitutional guarantees, no rights, no call on them to defend us. That's how they are subverting the Constitution and getting around the public law to do all this crap, by stealing our identity as Americans. So what happens when 50 million of us realize this and say, I am an American born on the land and soil of New Jersey, for example, and I have expatriated from any form of federal citizenship and provided notice to all you rats on your own public record. Big news, rats, I am your employer. The guy you owe all your good faith service to. I am here to collect on that. You boys are on the hook to defend me, so better get busy defending me and my state and my best interests, or bubba, it's pink slip time. Please hit subscribe, like, share, embed, and get ready for many more Anna Von Wright's videos.